My name is Matt Baker, and I teach an undergraduate leadership course and a number of graduate courses, including multivariate statistics, research methods, program evaluation, and the undergraduate courses uh, organizational leadership. I was thinking this morning at home that I've been in Casper now going almost 40 years, 40 years at UCLA next year in 2017. I came as an undergraduate here, fell in love with tech. I, this is something I enjoy doing, I, uh, is to give back through uh, trying to help universities and colleges, both in Africa and Asia. So I, I usually travel uh, for two to three weeks in the summer and uh, work in places that a lot of people don't want to go. Um, the U.S. government is trying to invest in countries that's kind of the tip of the spear civil unrest and the rest. Uh, the other area is in, in cognitive science. We're just finishing our first study on psychophysiology, We're looking at heart rate and uh, eye twitching and some other physiological responses to decision making. And I'm really interested in that. And the third piece is eye tracking. Uh, so we're working towards that area as well. So they say the eyes don't lie. So. Uh, you know, you can tell what someone's thinking or someone's engaged by looking at the eyes. Uh, I love the people, I love our students, and our students fundamentally haven't changed a lot uh, from my perspective, which is a good thing. We have such good students uh, in Kazdar. Uh, I, I don't know, I just I gush when I talk about Kazdar because I think it's just a great institution here at Texas Tech. I'm excited about you guys and where, you know, where, where you're going after graduation and what you're doing. Uh, I think our quality increases as well as our number of students. Uh, Dr. Baker, he's an extremely efficient man. You know, everything that you do in his classes, there's a reason for it. I've really enjoyed having him as a professor. And to describe him in one word, I'd say knowledgeable. You know, if you have a question, he's going to have an answer for you. Part about being in Casmar at Texas Tech is that we still have that at home feeling here. I had a student come in my office a few, uh, few years, two years ago, I think. And I looked at his name and where he was from, and I said, you know, I don't know you, but I really know you. Uh, I taught your dad in high school. I went to, I, I knew your dad, your grandfather. I went to church with your grandfather, and I knew your great-grandfather. But I've never met you. <laughs> so, you know, we still have those connections uh, to people we know in the region.